here with G-Squared Tactical. Got something on the channel today that I'm not so sure that everybody's going to be super excited about looking at or clicking on. Let you guys see how awesome it is for something to barely even make a sound. But I'm excited about it. Uh, every time I've walked in, Trey in, in, inherited this uh, little, what is, what is it? Uh, yours is a 25, though. Right, it's a it's a Bursa. Uh, the the little one he inherited from his uh, from his grandmother or something like that, and every and it looks just like this, very similar to it. And every time I seen it, I wanted it. So I've already done the tabletop on this. You guys already know all the intricals of it. It is a Beretta Tomcat Covert 32 Auto. And today we're just gonna shoot this thing. I brought about a hundred rounds to the range. We're gonna have a little fun with it. And I promise you that you wanna watch this video to the very end because we're gonna do something real special with this old girl. So let's go ahead and put some down rain. This is a uh, double action, single action, double action. So we're just gonna start from there. This is the first shots with this gun. So y'all should consider yourself uh, lucky to See the very first shot. We didn't try it off camera. We're just gonna shoot it. Well, might want to knock my safety off. All so we had one fail to feed. Those sights are impossible to see. Those sights are impossible to see with uh, a black target that we're shooting at down there. And these sights are black and they're like revolver sights. You can hardly see them. I mentioned that in the tabletop. But still a blast to shoot. You know, I kind of like to do the thumbs forward. Um, just being so small, that's kind of a little bit of a difficult thing to do. But Unfortunately, it only came with one mag, so we're going to have to stop, load up, shoot again. We'll let Trey shoot it a little bit, but hey, don't get bored with it. Something special is coming up. Trey's going to shoot it right quick because, you know, this is right up his alley, but um, this, this type of gun because, you know, he likes small things. Okay. But anyway, so he's going to show you how to pop the barrel up here. So you, you just slide this lever forward. No, there you go. Pops up like that, and then you just slide around in the barrel. For your plus one capacity lock it back in and then slap your magazine up in the mag well just like what we talked about during the tabletop but just thought we'd kind of do a, a real life and uh he's gonna see if he can get on that target we still got 10 grand on best shot right man that's a lot of money Ten thousand rounds oh ten thousand rounds oh 50 cal but well, that's still a lot of money that's right this trigger pulls horrible i can already tell just shoot the gun You got the crazy. safety on? Yeah. Yeah. If he, st if he starts hitting it, then he'll like it, but... Yeah. Uh-oh. Okay. So, so yeah he'll run his mouth if, about it if he don't shoot well with it but i'll tell you this right now it's eating you up it's eating me up but i'm okay with that that it's just awesome ain't it i really like the way that it i mean it you know we shoot nine millimeters 45s 223s a very uncommon round and an uncommon pistol it's a unique pistol it definitely has its type of market but these wood grips them are make freaking it awesome. lovable for anybody right i mean it's beautiful. and it feels good to shoat too yeah it, it really does, does. i mean I it like does that. it does that that first double action trigger pull is horrible but as i mentioned in the tabletop you can always bring your hammer back here and that's what i did if you guys paid attention well i pulled the hammer up. back so i could do it you could pull your hammer back and put the safety up so you can you can walk around with it uh with it cocked and the safety up and so you know that's probably if I carried it in my pocket, just like I do with my uh, with my 938. As you can see, I got it cocked, and the safety is up, and I've carried it like that for years. So that's how I would probably carry this one as well. I do agree with you on the sights, though. The They're sights are small. horrible. Sights very are horrible. Small. But 
You know, if it's a pocket pistol, you want, you know, low snag. That's right. We're just going to shoot this thing a good bit more here, and we're going to quit talking all together about it. Fail to feed. Probably me. I'm telling you, man, I'm bringing in those, uh, I'm bringing in them sights, and, uh, I think it's going to be, it's going to be all right. I think I might, I think I might find myself, uh, possibly pocket carrying this old thing. Anyway, it's time for the, uh, the special treat we had promised you guys. Uh, but there ain't a whole lot of people out there who have, currently are, or in the future looking to suppress a 32 auto. But it's about to happen today. But we are. On G squared tactical. Taking the ears off. Don't need them anymore. No, you do not. Now, we are not going to hit the broad side of a barn because, uh, I'm not going to be able to see my sights at all because the little Tomcat don't have suppressor height. That suppressor's sight. about twice the length of the Tomcat. The sweet, sweet little Tomcat. But you know the suppressor's so light you can't hardly even, can't hardly even tell it. Let's, let's do it. Let's the do sweet it. but deadly Tomcat. No ear protection. And I say that uh, since I'm not going to hit this target because, well, yeah. Because I can't see the sight. But so I say we just one hand rapid fire. Might even go a little gangster because, you know, the only thing that we're trying to do is let you guys see how awesome it is for something to barely even make a sound. But it still goes bang. So let's 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 go gangster on this one. Let's hit that mud puddle down there. <laughs> Let, let's go all gangster on them, you know. Oh, did you see that? That's awesome. You gotta tell it. You gotta let him see he that hit water it. splash. Let him see that water splash. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Dude. <laughs> That's awesome. Dude. Are you serious? <laughs> That's the most awesome thing that I've seen all day. And hey, you know how when we were suppressing that nine millimeter earlier, it got super hot. Like there's no warmth to this whatsoever. Really? Let me feel of that. Yeah, feel of that. Feel of that. Get you a good feel. Not at hey, all. Hey, Chris. How about that? <laughs> um, that is freaking awesome. However, here's my deal with this gun. I don't know exactly how you would get a suppressor height front sight for that as it's molded <laughs> into the barrel there. Yeah, you're going to um, have difficulty. But, I mean, it's freaking awesome nonetheless. So, uh, dude, that was one of the most awesome things that I had done. And it'll pop up. That is legit. Wait, wait, are you serious? That is wait, awesome. That is the most awesome thing I have done in a long time. That is, that is insane. Um, in so much so that I want to get this on our iPhone camera so that when we leave here today, um, I can send it to our friend Junior because I know he'll be so jealous. So jealous. <laughs> well, why don't I, I'm going to stop here and we're going to pick up with the iPhone once we get loaded up and we're going to sling some more suppressed 32 auto shots down range. This Beretta Tomcat is awesome. It's awesome suppressed and it's awesome when it's not suppressed. It's functioning flawlessly. We had a couple failure to feed in the beginning, but I would highly recommend this gun. And you're not gonna carry it suppressed or even use it for home defense suppressed, but you are gonna have a freaking awesome time.
That's all kinds of awesome right there. Yeah. So this is the suppressed uh, Beretta Tomcat. We, we said that like, so casually, like it's... Yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> we're, 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 well, no, no, we're acting like that we're doing a, a review on the, uh, the, the the suppressor here, but in reality, look at all this GSR. Oh, yeah. But in reality, we're, we're reviewing the, uh, the Beretta Tomcat Covert 32 ACP with the uh, walnut grips on here. She's a beauty. And I am having so much fun. I, when I seen this gun in the store, everybody said, why? My wife said, why? Everybody said, why? I said, because it feels really nice in the hand. I actually like how it looks. And I truly, truly believe that it's going to be a blast to shoot. And it is. And it has been. And uh, even more so. You also said I'm gonna slap a suppressor on this baby and really let I did it ring. Say that. I yeah. Did say that. I said, who, who would put a suppressor on this? Well, we answered that question today. Yes, sir. Me and Trey is who would do that, and uh, we ain't got but a few more rounds, as you can see. But um, we're gonna finish it off trying to hit this water a few times. But if you've looked at this gun, and honestly, I was doing halfway decent hitting the target, even with these sights. If you've looked at this gun, I honest to God think that it could be a um, a good pocket carry pistol. And if nothing else, a novelty, something you would certainly have fun with. It's very usable. So uh, make sure you hit that uh, that thumbs up and make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Because you definitely want to subscribe to that awesome.